sounds like it. Well, let's go looking for these squirrels and try and finish this off. Uh, but I'm not going to go out my way to it. <laughs> I'll do it in another time. Yeah. She does that. Another food topper. It's me. Oh. See you around. Oh, we're both on first nine bases. Well, with the hundreds, of course. <laughs> yes, you do. Seriously, Yag. Okay, now I'll tell you that. Okay. Well. Okay, so... Unfair advantage, yeah. Yeah, I'd love to be able to do that. Unfair advantage to those stupid silly games. Alright, so. So I'm going to ignore the. the, uh, the signal on the gymnasium. Um, I mean, everything else is no, I can still do it. Okay, I'm gonna ignore. Actually, let's do it. Let's go and do the oops, sorry. Nah. Did you have business with Sawa Sensei? Yeah, the faculty meeting's over, right? It just wrapped up. But Sawa Sensei went home in the middle of it, about an hour ago. What? Apparently, she got a call from her apartment manager saying her place was broken into. Broken oh. into? She told me to tell you that if you came around. Okay, then. Do you think you could give me her contact info or something? No, I don't think I can. Oh, I'll just give her a quick call. One moment. Yes. No joy? No, she's not answering. They're probably busy. But I guess she's home then? I'd say so. Her place is within walking distance. It is? Sawa Sensei lives in Ijincho? Uh, yes, but I really shouldn't be giving that kind of info out. Sure, I appreciate the need for privacy. You've been a big help. Yeah, I'll just find someone up the food train that can give me the information. Okay, let's check. 
Right, so okay. attack um, yeah okay uh, well, don't need that don't need anything that hmm okay yeah let's find the um, I'm just uh, okay. So okay. Uh, um. Um. Ah, there we go. Um, that should do. Okay. Here, must do now. Well, I can. You're my only hope. Give me the ends. What's the matter, Yagami-san? Is there still something you need? Well, do you think you could tell me Sawa-sensei's address? Come again? Not too long ago, she got a call that her apartment was broken into. And another teacher tried to call her, but she wouldn't answer. So, what? Are you going to go check on her yourself? At her place? She's within walking distance, isn't she? I believe so. But this is a young woman, living by herself. I shouldn't be giving you her address without her permission. We're detectives. Give us a bit of time, I'm sure we can find out ourselves. But on the other hand, that wouldn't be best for either party now, would it? Then can't you just ask her yourself tomorrow? Chairman, you're aware of the Hiro Mikoshiba murder footage, right? Yes, of course I am. But from what I've heard from police sources, it's very likely that video was faked. Well, I have it on good authority it wasn't faked at all. So for the sake of argument, let's say the video is real. And that Ahara is the one behind having posted it deliberately. He's got the criminal affairs department saying it's probably fate. So the police are playing right into his hand. And let's say his motive in all this is to avenge his son's suicide. Justice for his bullying that he never got. Now wait just a moment. We proved in court that no bullying had taken place here. Sad as it was, the trial concluded that bullying wasn't what drove poor Eharakun to suicide. Actually, before Toshiro-kun killed himself, Sawa-sensei reported a bullying incident to his homeroom teacher. What? But at the trial, she wasn't able to testify to that. She had no choice but to deny the whole thing. From Ahara's perspective, that was unforgivable. And after all that, Mikoshiba was murdered. And now Sawa-sensei isn't picking up her phone, following a break-in at her place. What are you implying here? It's like you're saying she's going to be next. I'm I just want to check up on her. If it turns out the break-in isn't linked, I'll turn right around. And I'll make sure nobody knows the chairman gave me her address. Well, fine. I understand. Yep. Now, a smart thing for you to do, which you probably won't do, probably I can't do, is to call the eyes. But looks like you. Um, yep. Looks like, oh, the, the points, let's see, what, 3,000, let's see. Okay, that's. And that. And that. Learn that. Okay. <sighs> okay.
okay off to the uh, presumed rescue So, where are we going? Uh, that's walking distance. Alright, so I shall... Make it easy. Cubby distance. Now it's easy walking distance. Right, apartment 304. Yep, don't think go go all the way over and see what's up. Look who it is. Oh, that's all. Kawana? What the hell are you doing here? <laughs> that was quick. I guess we couldn't ask for a better piece of bait. Kick us off, Akutsu. And now last, on a bit of a stare down. Okay, that's two chapters down. Chapter five and chapter six. So next time we'll be doing chapter seven. Called blindsided.